Ashton Rowe and Zayed Ahmed are the assistants. The whistle goes, and we're off. And it's Meppen Walters who plays a long ball down the right-hand side to uh, get things underway. And uh, Ross Daly <laughs> commits the first get foul of the afternoon to concede a free kick for Gainsborough. The way we started against Radcliffe. Boateng plays it forward. Chase on here for Ross Daly in the middle of the park. Wins the ball, plays it out to Smales Braithwaite. He's got Smith on the overlap. Cuts inside and plays it in with his right boot. It's a decent curl on the ball, but just a little bit too high for Backer to get underneath it. And it's out and behind for a goal kick. And there's uh, Gate. As guys who get the throw on the right-hand side. Played infield. Helped on by uh, Mark Lees. One back on this right-hand side as Murphy's trying to find a, an angle through it. So it's back or he's got the ball down to bay line into the uh, six-yard box. Murphy was in there, but it was cleared before it could find its way through to him. But decent run there from Scott Backer. Really promising. Nice bit of play. Throw on the right-hand side. Sent forward by Boateng. Returned into the Lions' half. Smith... Tidies up, gives it to Mepp and Walters under pressure from DeRose. Very calm and collected. George Smith into the feet of Smells Braithwaite, who takes a really heavy touch first time, but gets it back under control and starts to run with the ball over the halfway line. Little layoff here to Whelan. Gets it back. Smells Braithwaite, edge of the area, gets a shot away, but it had the power, but not the direction. It was wide of the upright, but it was a lovely bit of interplay to get to the edge of the area there from Smells Braithwaite. Unfortunately, just didn't have the finish. It's still... Nil-nil, 24 minutes gone. That's fantastic. It came all the way from Mepp and Walter and Smith at the back, didn't it? And uh, up right to the edge of their box. Decent effort. Kogel, it'll be a guysy throw. Midway through the Gainsborough half. Flick on from Murphy. Taken down by Backer into the penalty area. Gets his left foot lined up for the shot. But is blocked by Isaac Rice. And it goes through to the goalkeeper. A really good opportunity, that. Lovely work, and... Just the signs of a partnership there, perhaps between Murphy and Becker. Yes, they've, they've linked a couple of times on that right side. And it was good defending in the end that uh, stopped that. Because the problem, you know, coming off the back of the last two performances, if they score first, then confidence could go on there. Oh, Becker has won the ball down the right-hand side. He's played it well. It's into the box, headed away by Hornshaw. Takes a deflection, then eventually booted away as the Lions win it back with Lees. Nods forwards towards the edge of the 18-yard box. And there's a foul. Referee has seen it. The ball is out anyway on the halfway line. It's won by Gainsborough for a, a throw. Smith just placing that one out. Donaldson collects it. He's uh, done well to play it from that side to the left-hand side. And a nice move here for a, a shot that comes away. Cam Mason holds it just before Donaldson can reclaim the rebound. The effort from Joe West on that left-hand side after being played in by Donaldson was a long ranger. Just for a minute, looked like it might escape the clutches of Cam Mason. Eventually picked up by... The visitors who play it down towards Donaldson, right-hand side. Opportunity as we come close to the half-time mark. Donaldson, trying to get away from Meppen Walters, does well, plays it out to the left-hand side. Finds West. West, who's had a, a shot on target earlier in this game. The cross goes into the box, headed away, picked up again, this time right. The captain leading, scurrying down towards the corner flag to try and keep this one in play. But he won't get time. The half-time whistle goes. First 45 minutes... Pretty much lacking in goal mouth action. The best chance perhaps fell to Gainsborough with a long-range shot that was spilled by Mason. Only temporarily claimed it before Donaldson could pounce. Guys, you've had uh, plenty of the ball in the final third. Yet to show the deadly finish that is required to get the goal. And so at half-time, it's scoreless. It's uh, guys in nil, Gainsborough Trinity nil. I think 10, uh, 9, 10, 11 players that were involved that night, including Jack Dyche, are in this squad today. So Gainsborough have been the model of consistency in that respect. They've uh, pressed the ball forward here as they start this second period. And Dice is trying to get involved up against uh, Courtney Mepp and Walters. Throw here from West. On this left-hand side, about level with the energy of the penalty area. Gets it into the box. It's loose and it's free and it's a goal. Liam Waldock with the goal on 45 minutes. Just this worst possible start to the second half. 
Gainsborough have come out of the traps and they've come out flying and unfortunately the Lions find themselves a goal behind after Liam Waldock finds some space in the area capitalises on the rebound and it's now guys in ilk Gainsborough 1 they'll throw in for the Lions on the halfway line Lewis has played well hasn't he we were, we were gawping at his uh, birth date as uh, old people do I think 2004 he was uh, on loan from Scunthorpe as well free kick now for Geisley so uh, Lee stands over this one he's probably going to try and poke it towards you the penalty area towards Meppen Walters takes a, a deflection off uh, the head of Cogill doesn't go out for a corner but he's picked up by the lines and crossed back into the box Daly with a header misdirects picked up again the lines get the ball into the area and again it's a bit loose spin and shot from Asento but it goes high and wide. It was a difficult chance for him. Mason now with a clearance. Up towards uh, Murphy, who wins the header. The flick on towards back. Up. Just didn't quite work out on that occasion. Again, sniff of a combination, though. Beginning to work. Back and now through to Lewis Hay. Edge of the area, Lewis Hay. Left foot. How oh, fires wide. Fires wide and over. Oh, that would have been perfect opportunity for Lewis Hay to make his mark. He made a lovely run, got into the edge of the area and then just couldn't keep his shot down. Lovely. Still 1-0 to Gainsborough. It's uh, currently Glover, the substitute on the ball for Gainsborough on the right-hand side as they're looking for a way through the Lions' defence on that flank. Ross Daly with a good clearance. Up in the air, taken down now by Murphy. Good touch from Callan Murphy. Plays the ball over the top. Lewis Hay made a surging run forward. It, trying to get in between the two defenders. Gets an angle. Could lay it off here for Backer, who shoots and gets underneath it. And again, a disappointing finish, but a good move over the top. Nice play there from Lewis Hay, who caused the two defenders trouble. Found the ball. Found the pass to Scott Backer well, but Backer just couldn't apply the finish. And it's uh, another one that's in the car park. Still... Games were lead by a goal to nil, 72 minutes gone. Hay, good time for a good ball into the box. It's a decent one, but it's headed away by the defence. Still not cleared. Whelan gets a shot, takes a deflection. It might uh, go out for a corner. No, the goalkeeper manages to scurry across and prevent that from happening. Headed on by Can. Nodded back by Daly. Back into the feet of Smales Braithwaite, who have a little run down that left-hand side. Good overlapping run here. Chance to get into the box and uh, maybe get the cross in towards the area. There's a challenge and Backer's uh, not able to win the corner from that either. He... So the uh, free kick from uh, Can played forward as Gainsborough look just to uh, work down the clock now because there's four minutes of stoppage time to be played. Oh, loose balls. Found Donaldson in the box. He takes a shot. Great save from Mason at his near post. Donaldson didn't need a much of an invitation to shoot. That one was well saved. Dyche now with the ball. Plays it right across the face of the six-yard box. Picked up by Lewis. Harry Lewis on the left-hand side. Intercepted by Boateng. Takes a deflection off Lewis. And the, Not for the goal kick is given. Not for the first time that today. I'm going to say great defending Boateng again. If we can. Jack Dyche is definitely not retreating the ten yards there. <laughs> He's going to be urged back by the referee. And Dyche... Decides to go back into the box in any case. Gardner floats the ball up in the air. Meppen Walters chests down. Still not cleared. Meppen Walters will just about win it on the edge of the area, but he can't force it forward. And the clock beats Geisley, as does Gainsborough, thanks to a, an early goal in the second half from Liam Waldock that caught Geisley napping after a deflection. Found Waldock free. He placed the ball well past Mason, but the Lions pressed, pushed. But couldn't make their way through and several players just down on the ground disappointed with the defeat today it's a uh, another scoreless game for Geisley as well another blank sheet for the strikers and it's finished here Geisley nil Gainsborough 1